Alright, so here's the nail polish look that we're going for. It's red with gold. This is going to be the first holiday look that I'm showing. And I'll show you the products that I've used. Uh, this is Bonder by Orly and it's a rubberized base coat. Um, but what I will say is if you're not going to do your nails all in one sitting, um, don't use this and then come back and do your nails, you know, later on. Um, because I noticed since it is very thin, as you can see here, how easily it moves in the bottle. It's not like a normal nail polish. Um, what I've done before is I've put this on as a base coat and then gone back to do my nails later on. And I've noticed that it scratches very easily. Um, so you won't have a, a nice base. Um, so it's best to do it all in one sitting. Next, take your favorite red nail polish. I used OPI in color So Hot It Burns. That color there. And then I took uh, Goldmine by Wet n Wild. Um, this isn't my favorite gold um, because it is very opaque. Excuse me, I mean it is very transparent. So you have to do a couple of coats of this. And then I'm using this here, it's just gold, it's just a gold um, glitter, and this is, uh, you can pick this up at Forever 21. And then as the top coat, I used this uh, Sesh Feet, which is really excellent. And then another item that you'll need is just a little um, makeup sponge, and just tear a little piece of it, you don't need a huge piece. Alright, so I already used the, um, the base coat, and then I did um, two coats of the red here. So next I'm going to be taking um, the gold, uh, and then I'm going to be taking a little piece of plastic, and I'm just going to pour some of that out onto the plastic. So now I'm going to be taking, um, oh, and then what I did here, so I don't know if you can see, on the right hand is I went from right to left, um, but more on the left side you leave um, a lot of the red showing through. I don't know if you can see that. So on the right, on the left hand, I'm going to be going from left to right, so I'm going to be leaving more of the red showing on the right side of the nail. So I'm just going to dip my sponge into the gold, and I'm just going to be pressing that down. Just like that. And like I said, this color is very opaque, or transparent. <laughs> um, so you'll have to do a couple of coats of the gold, because it's not showing up as as not as dark as I would like it. So I'm going to let that dry just a little tiny bit. Oh, and another thing that I want to mention is if you are in a hurry um, to do your nails and you're not going to have time to wait for the red polish to dry, um, then apply a coat of the Sesh Vite after your red polish and before the gold and that will help the process um, speed up just a little bit. So I'm going to let this dry and I will be right back. Okay, so I went ahead and let that dry for a couple minutes and then just added um, added the second coat, which I'll just show you once again. Just do it random spots like that. It's not a particular pattern going on. You're just, you know, doing it mostly, like I said, on your left hand, you go from the left to the right. Um, but you're going to be leaving the right area with more of the red showing through. Okay, and then next I'm taking the gold glitter, and I'm going to apply this just on the, um, on top of the gold glitter. So you don't want to go on to the red, so you're going to leave this area blank right there. So I'll show you once again. Okay. 
just keeping it where you have the gold. And on my other hand I did two um, coats of the gold glitter. Um, oops, I hope you didn't hear my tummy right now. Um, but I think it looks a little bit better with just one coat of the of the glitter. But if you like a lot of glitter, then you should definitely go for the two coats. So here's the difference. This one has two coats of the gold glitter. And that one has just one. Don't know if you can tell the difference. Um, but I'm going to have them even, so I'm going to do another coat of the gold glitter on this hand. So I'm going to do that, and I will be right back. Alright, so I've let that dry, so I'm just going to use um, the sesh feet. Um, this is a great... Um, super quick top coat. Um, you can literally do your nails, you know, and then walk out the door five minutes later and you're not going to mess up your nails. It's fantastic. Alright, so there is the finished look. I will post a picture at the end as well. If you have any questions or any requests, please let me know.